Hello, I'm back. Uh, do I keep that size now? I guess I do. So, welcome back, silly who, and back on 2B. And yeah, since the server restart kind of interrupted me, I forgot where I left off. Oh, I don't have to eat myself anymore. I'm, I'm not used to that. I I don't know what I was uh, I was doing. So Oh, you can also press it twice. C plus X minus. Wait. What? Is it, see, I'm confused by the radar. I am going X minus C plus. So this is in front of me, which would make sense. And it also kind of rotates with me. But yeah, I'm, I'm used to having X before Z and that's why they are kind of switched. That's weird. Anyways, so I think I was scanning um, my, uh, my modules for stuff I want to um, explore. I don't know where I left off. I think somewhere here. Um, oh, oh, that's what, what the fake player is used for, that your enemies attack fake players. Wait, what? No. Can you create players that other players see, I doubt that. Aimbot, okay. <laughs> Infinite and way easier elytra fly. Oh, that's nice. Wait. That is nice. I love that one. That is actually important. Like, that is something I've never seen that or I've never... Oh, why, why do I walk so weird? Um, that is... Um, yeah, that, that is, yes, that should be default in a vanilla client, in my opinion. Such a crucial feature. Cool, that's, that's really cool, I love it. So, that should always be activated. Wait, does it also work in, oh nice. Imagine how fast you can react if you're in an escape in the menu and then something happens. That's great. But what happens if I tap out of the game? Then I can't do it. Which makes sense, you might say. But I can also click if I'm tapped out of the game. So that, that's that. 
Wow. No way. No way. Oh my gosh. That is that is cool. No, you bitch. Um I can auto eat pause baritone deactivate that and now I should be I I don't know how they interfere with each other. Mm. If Baritone then tries to do something and things might go wild. But now I should be able to eat while while I'm running. So that is crazy. Uh, which one was it? Where auto eat? Uh, how did I get there? Like what? Ah, no slowdown. I was here. Sprint automatically makes the player sprint. I wish this had more detail on how it does it. Prevents being kicked by clicking on books. Are you sure you want to disconnect? <gasps> Should I give it a try? Should I press this button? Okay, I will do it. That's so YOLO. I am such a savage. Okay, that works. That is, I mean, I usually think that disconnecting fast is a feature and I've used it um, a lot in my Minecraft history, especially when playing um, vanilla with friends and shit and a creeper sneaks up on me. I scream and I disconnect and I call my friends and like help kill this creeper please kill or kill the mobs around me and stuff like that oh wow that is nice ESP um, but on 2b I should um, stop using that habit of like quickly disconnecting when I'm in a dangerous situation because it kicks me back to the queue and there's nobody who will help me maybe there are some situations um, but I can still train it to to do that quickly, um, so that's fine. But um, there's a, also another use case for this anti disconnect is uh, which I already like told you in this episode and many others is that if I tap out of the game and I keep full screen open, which you know you actually expect to work, uh, you just want to tap out of the game, um, and I click somewhere. I'm not clicking on the application that I have like highlighted. I'm actually clicking in game. And if I then click on this connect button, I get disconnected. So that gives an extra um, save uh, there. So that's actually cool. I should keep that activated at all times. I, th I can replace my texture pack. Um, my transparent texture pack I made, I can um, replace my uh, boss bar texture pack I made, I can um, replace my fire overlay texture pack I made, I can replace my weather texture pack I made, and I can even replace the texture pack that I failed to make, the x-ray one. I'm wondering what kind of texture packs are even left over? UI, boss bar, weather, fire, x-ray. So all of my texture packs are included in this client. Um, and they are probably better and easier toggable. So I guess I go with them. Mm. Uh, 
Or should I keep them activated? I'm, I'm not sure right now. Resource packs. Yeah, let's... Okay. Back to normal, huh? So let me see how this stuff looks like. Ah, that's awesome. Did you see it? He kept running while eating. Ah. Wait, what parts? Wait, it says clean modifies parts of the inventory chat. Wait, inventory. It says inventory. If I say transparent inventory, if I s like see transparent inventory, I expect a transparent inventory. But this one seems to be broken. That is, uh, that is sad because, um, yeah. Okay, then I will reactivate. But the menu looks nicer without. I should probably change my texture pack to be um, less ugly. In combination with walking, that is nice. Walking while having the inventory open. That is nice. What? So imagine you're like fighting and all and you're like bam 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 and then you're running away and then you activate and then you can look back and um, still punch your enemies, can you? <laughs> I don't know. Can I? So that's that's kind of cool. Let's see. Wait, are we going in the right direction? Always make sure to go in the right direction, and then make sure again, and then make sure again. So let's synchronize our blocks. Uh, I can probably also do that in here. Wait, let's do it in here first. Um, what was it? Was it an exploit? Was it a... Hmm... Can't find it. No glitch blocks. Here. Yeah, it seems like I can't really interact with the world at all. I can eat, but I can't place blocks. That's probably because it's using baritone and baritone is doing shit for me. Okay, so that's that. Um, I guess I don't need a yaw bind then. I could keep it on Y, but I think left and right arrow is kind of cool. Mm. Do you have something like that? That's probably, what is it? And what category was it here? It was in movement. Movement, why? There's no yaw. Come on, center me, boy. So 
So, did I check out all modules now? I think I was here. Anti-weather and I kept it. Well, I can activate it next time. I want to actually see some proper weather and then be annoyed by it and then be pleased to be able to deactivate it. Auto fish. Auto mine. Wait. Is that the thing that people are talking about? Like I just put on auto mine when I'm AFK. I can just get some diamonds when I'm AFK. What does it do when the inventory is full though, or when the pickaxe breaks? I would love to see, like in my next base, I'm definitely exploring all the mine and what it does. Yeah, that one I can activate in queue when I go AFK for a longer time. In case of a timeout or shit. Oh, I thought you can apply a beacon effect regardless of a beacon being there or not. What's that? What? Oh, it also has this feature, but it's the act this is upside down are you kidding me down is up and up is down wow this climb is weird as what is this thing what is it is it a pig man um so i activated right click blocks to display their data where do you get displayed though That didn't work out too well. Wait, am I getting followed? What is this? What what was going on there? That was spooky, man. So, yeah, that's weird. Love it. <laughs> that that makes some good screenshots. Wonderful. I love such things, I don't know. I mean some people might say that's useless and all like how is it with breaking blocks? Is it like also faking that on the client side? Yeah, a little bit at least. I mean it probably also works with um Yeah, that's nice. That makes for some nice screenshots. <laughs> Wait, I deactivated it. Are you kidding me? So, correct direction. Yes. Oh, I'm attacking, attacking it. Wait, it actually stops moving, does it? It's like, no, I don't want to move. I, I see a player. Oh, my free cam from um, Salhek. Should probably use the free cam from. That is something I have to rebind. 
That is something I have to rebind. Logs, like, what does it log? Does it log um, the mm, the coordinates or shit, or like just a timestamp? to Manchester demos and servers that block it. <laughs> oh my gosh, prevents lag caused by sound machines. Wait, sound machines. I read it the other way around. I, I was like, I understood uh, prevent sounds from lag machines, but what are sound machines? Uh, Skin flicker. Can I see it myself? Nah. So where's the free cam? Free cam. Is it more pleasant than in cell hack? Yes, definitely. It's so much better. It's way better. Oh my gosh. This client is so much better. It, I feel bad because cell hack is kind of cool and it's a smaller client and it was my first client and I, f I feel like an ass who's like, oh, well, I found a better client. But this is, yeah, this is it. Not going to use uh, cell hack again. Um, yes, okay, so let's go here. Free cam, free cam. Where are you? Bind, page down, and we go here to free cam nope and we bind it to r oh i love it that's such a good free cam that's so much fun <laughs> that completely changed the game on like how my uh, 2 way to t travel highway travels will look like uh, I can actually search bases surrounding the highway I can be more safe I can be more AFK this client is a huge upgrade uh, it's free and open source by the way I compiled it myself I didn't audit the source code though it has 61 contributors and um, I w it was just a spontaneous thing I did uh, yesterday night so that's that it's awesome <laughs> that is like in cell hack you, you you get stuck randomly and um, it, it's really unpleasant to to fly fly around but this is this is real fun man especially if you if you know the stacked version um, I mean that's what I expected from Sal hex free cam and that's why I probably never really used it um, as long as I'm doing it right now I wouldn't say it's my first time using um, hacked clients but uh, I used Nodos back in the days for a few, I, would, I don't want to say days, 
but like that's what it kind of boils down to uh and what did i use i use x-ray but not like really actively i was, I was like what did i use it for I used it on my own server where I played for like one hour in total, maybe. And one on another build server of some friends of mine where I used where I played on the server in total on t like twenty minutes. Mm. I might have used like some aimbot. I don't know. Probably didn't use that one. Um. Yeah, it, it was different times, so I, I've for sure never used something like auto walk. I've, of course, also never felt the need for it because I was never walking highways and shit. And, um, but wait, what is this tunnel? Is that even possible in, um, can you do that in this version in 1.12? Can you, can you be flat or did someone f dig it first and then fill it up? What a sneaky side tunnel. Yeah, like, remember back, well, if you watched all the episodes, uh, remember back to the episodes where I got lost on the highway and I was like, of some, some, um, on some of these off forks, like here, and I was like, ah, where am I? And I would be like walking here and like, ah, no, and then I would be there. But like, imagine back then I would like, pew, free cam or pew x-ray and everything would be fine um yeah it's it's really nice to have these binds i yeah now i have a free y bind that um probably will be useful for a different hack but r uh free cam x x-ray e inventory q drop item uh wasd walking F emotes, no F is switching off and right. <laughs> no emotes. <laughs> um, anyways, so that's kind of cool. Um, but also, it seems like this client does not have any mini games that I can play while uh, walking on the highway. So, oh wow, it's 20. Let's remember that. I think fast is nice. I think fast is nice for like a quick skim of the location. I mean, yes, it is more annoying to go through this cave and do shit, um, but that's not what I do with a free cam. I, I do a quick skim, bam, bang. That's what the location looks like. And um, fast is nice. Fast is nice. Let's not crank it too fast and let's make it fast here as well. And then we go like, bam. yeah, that's nice. That's nice. I love it. I love it. Remember the times where I had to like keep myself busy by looking at the scoreboard? Now I can do <laughs> okay sorry um anyways so did we look through everything i think we did nice um seems like cell hack is almost completely replaced except the coordinates <laughs> you must be kidding me um you must be kidding me render armor hard where is it? Ah, that's that one. That's the classical one that everybody has. I, I've never like seen D. Well, in PvP, it's useful and all, but height. Huh. Huh, interesting. So you can see skins. Like, imagine you are in like a PvP of like well-equipped players everybody's running around with enchanted diamond um, armor and uh, you can hardly distinguish players you always have to look at names and shit 
and then you can hide armor and look at the skins that's actually kind of nice um, I've never been in such a fight. Well, have I been in such a fight? I've seen plenty of players on a small space, like let's say four to five, six, seven, eight players uh, with full enchanted diamond armor on some PvP servers. Um, good old times. What was the name? Like it was a small PvP server with like, I think 32 slots and, um, or was it? 64 slots with around 30 players online something like that and um, That was good times man good times um, Wait Poo Remember when I was like still using vanilla and I had this x-ray hack where, when in specific occasions I was like using a five and <laughs> and I was able to see a, a little portion of like something like this. <laughs> Is it useful though? I mean I could also... Which is actually faster since I only have to press the button once with F5. That is. Yeah, I don't know. Ba, 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 ba. Yeah, I wish that one works and that one would work. Because, like, no, still showing not all players and not more players, and this is not making my inventory transparent. Um, I wonder if there are open issues about that. Let me let me look it up. Also, regarding the, <laughs> I don't know if you can see it, but, oh, it's fixed. <laughs> it's fixed. How is it fixed? Do you see it? It's fixed. The graphical bug is fixed. I, I repeat, it is fixed. Wait. Then I can play in this size, actually. That would be awesome. Oh my gosh, imagine playing in my favorite scale um, on 2B. So, uh, yeah, okay, let's keep that activated. Let's keep the hut activated, but what are colors? Whatever. Oh, wow. Um, I was reading Pedor here. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, bah, 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 uh, what do I want? Yes. Okay, so I can move that one up here. I cannot scale it, can I? Still can't scale shit. I will probably block all my direction is nice as well. Inventory might be blowed. If I put it up here, yes, the watermark. I'm a fan of Salhek and I support it and all, but if Salhek would support proper scaling, I would keep showing the watermark. Oh my gosh, what is going on here? Oh, I want to see Baritone in action. Doing so well. Um, so notifications. Yeah, let's not show notifications. Keep that one up here. Keep that one up here. And then do not show the array list. And 
Maybe. Well, it looks kind of functional to me. It looks kind of functional to me. Then we can rescale the chat. Oh my gosh, this is so nice. And Kami Blue, well, wait, and Kami Blue supports proper um, hard scaling. That is amazing. Okay, like, I, I almost have everything I've ever dreamed about. Uh, is there something missing? Yes, um, UI wise, oh, it's so big. It almost feels too big now, but keep in mind an inventory cannot be too big. It makes you so much faster interacting with shit. Um, it's it's so good. Um, and also the menu, like clicking around here, super nice. But yeah, coordinates, yikers. Um, but I don't need coordinates anymore since I have them displayed on top now. And uh, it, it looks kind of nice. It looks kind of nice. Um, I, well, maybe I keep cell hack for, <laughs> I keep the client with the buggy hut scaling for the hut. <laughs> yeah, seems like, um, well, bu buggy hut scaling. I mean, Minecraft is bugged in general. Or they don't support properly a big ass inventory. I mean, how convenient is it to have like stuff as big as possible? I mean, like, of course, do not have like the whole view blocked by coordinates and text and shit. And also not by the chat and um, also not by fire animation. Maybe my sword is a little bit big and shit, but if you want to interact with something, if you want to click shit, if you have to press buttons, if you're in a menu, if you're in a UI, if it's bigger, it's better. It's that simple. I don't know why society hasn't like realized it yet. I feel like a pioneer on that, um, on that topic with that opinion. I feel like kind of alone. Anyways, so let's uh, read through uh, Kami Blue issues. Invent well, self explanatory. Ah, yeah, Chris, what an ass. Uh, inventory preview, border outline option. Uh -huh. um, chat filter support boss bars. Chat filter, what? Um, I would like to go AFK and I, I know it's all kind of new and that actually makes me kind of nervous, but I should be safe to go AFK, like as safe as I've never been before. Like it's the safest setup I'm, I'm running since like over 140 whatever episodes on Tubi. I... I got a setup that is actually safe. So um, I should like chill. I'm still, I'm still terrified or like traumatized. Is it how you say it? Um, by my safe walk not working, but now I have something even better than safe walk, and it's it's crazy. Um, do I have safe walk activated though? Um, yes. I don't need it. Like, sure, wait. Okay, so what happens if I baritone now? It just goes down. So what? And if I have a safe walk activated and baritone, it will be like, fuck safe walk anyways. So, eat. Wait, let me, 
let me do some tests so I can go AFK like super um, super chilled can I find some lava that is nearby air jump what, what, what do people expect from an air jump is that one nearby enough? Might be. I hope I don't die during this test. Are you scared? Because I am. Woo, baby. Okay. How far can we push this shit? So, well, you can probably jump this one. Okay, let's see. So buggy, man. This climb is so good. I'm sorry for destroying the... Oh my gosh, I'm lagging. Oh, it is because if I sneak, it tries to be fast. And that is actually bad. I'd rather be not glitchy then. Should I put cobble in there and like uh, obsidian in there or cobble or coal? What am I doing here? <laughs> oh my gosh. I have to explain myself in a sign, of course. Of course, I do have to do that. Well. No. Yes. Silly hoon messed with the highway. Saw we. Watch on YouTube now. <laughs> what is this sign? <laughs> what is this? Silly hoon messed with the highway. Saw we. Watch on YouTube now. What 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 does it mean? Like sometimes I rant about people if they write something in chat or somewhere online. I'm like, what 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 is going on in, in some people's brains? And they usually they don't feel comfortable in the language and shit. And oh my gosh, this is this is the worst. Like, what is this supposed to mean? Like for real? Come on. Ah. Oh. Ba, 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 ba. Yeah, let's make a chest. Let's put some sticks in there. Add some. There's no real water, so I cannot like plant shit. But um, yeah. I, I know the episode, so I may I know the um, episode number. Let me quickly look it up. Wait. Uh, so I am uploading right now episode one four seven. So this is episode one four eight one hundred forty eight. Um, let, let's let's actually be more precise with it. Um, that's not what I wanted to do. What is it called? Silly Hoon Minecraft Anarchy 2B2T Episode 147 It is uh, 2020 
10, 0, 9. So, there are people that come by here and like, what fuck's going on here? Um, are able to exactly um, find this episode, which will, like I said on YouTube, Highway, YouTube, I hope people know what I'm talking about. Uh, Minecraft Anarchy 2v2t, episode 148, 2020, 9th of October. So, wow, I have space in my image right now. Why did I even. Nah, come on, fuck this. Let's keep this shit here for the person who finds it. It's not a trap. <laughs> um, warning sponsored by Zilihun.com. <laughs> what is this? What is this? Okay, anyways, let's go. Let's keep going. I'm I'm kind of hyped because I'm so uh, satisfied with my setup. I don't know if Auto Eat will. Eat my golden apple. I could look in the source code since I don't have it open and I don't have it downloaded on this device. And I wanted to go AFK, but then, you know, things happened. And I had to test if it's safe to go AFK. And now I forgot about going FK and now I remembered it and now I'm doing something else. So, yeet. No, and we climbed KME Blue. KME Code Source. Mm. So we want to search for auto eat. Auto eat. Kotlin. I have no clue about Kotlin to be honest. Um, wow, I probably need a. I don't even have syntax highlighting in VS Code. Is, how is it not like. Code faster than flow kind. Okay. Nice. Um Fish, puffer fish, clown fish, poisonous potato, spider eye, rotten flesh, chorus fruit. Only the good stuff. <laughs> uh, ah, he's not eating that shit. But what about golden apple? I don't see a golden apple to be is valid. Um. <laughs> it seems like it actually eats the golden apple. Oh my goodness. Ah. Ah. <laughs> Shit. Oh no. I mean, I have my x-ray now, so I can quickly... Ah, but I need them for like when I'm in danger and shit. Oh no, it ate my gapple. Uh, while I was checking the code, if it's eating the gapple, and I was like, oh no, there's no gapple, and I was like, eh, blah, blah, blah. and then oh fuck shit, that's like, I mean, at least I didn't go AFK. So all my golden apples would be gone now. So I still have three golden apples. Never trust auto eat. Not even in Kami Blue. Maybe that's worth the issue, is it? Um, for a poor people option to... I mean, I, I looked through the code, so yeah. 
there is no option for it. So, um, yeah, it's also like, but it's working better than in um, cell hack. That's nice. I mean, it's actually working. Um, I lost a golden apple. Oh my gosh, how many golden apples have I eaten without wanting to do so? How many? And I tried to abort it, do you see? <laughs> what was this? Oh my gosh, that, that is so funny. No, what, what, what did it eat? It's, it was a bread, right? You are not able to eat the apple. <laughs> Wait, I want I want to see if Baritone can eat. Can Baritone eat? Nah, I will check it after being AFK. So let's activate auto eat and then it will probably find the bread down there. It's not stupid, man. Um, yeah, I will AFK. I will go AFK for a short, short uh, amount of time. I'm back. So let's test if uh, Baritone can eat. I mean, I don't have Baritone activated. I only have Auto Walk activated. Is there a full Baritone thing? Probably not. I don't know. I mean, I only have Auto Walk, Auto Walk activated. 
and it is like ba -ba -ba, forward or to walk backwards burn the stable baritone what is regular mm -hmm, mm -hmm, disconnect Yeah, it seems like it, it won't eat, which um, oh, it's fair. Cool. Yeah, I guess I, I could just let it run and. But I doubt baritone will like PvP and bad trap at other players or shit like that. So the other player I once saw with the. Um, diamond uh, unenchanted diamond armor I was like oh it's it must be a bot it's probably baritone whatever because he doesn't react um, to what I'm doing and even when he plays to bad I was like ah that's probably automated but now I'm beginning to doubt that <laughs> I think Baritone is just good at finding a direction and walking. It does that really, really, really good. Um, but I guess that's it. It doesn't even eat. But it wants to interact with the inventory. Yeah, sure, because it uses tools. I guess if my pickaxe at the second slot will break, it will start using my fortune three pickaxe instead of getting another one. Yeah. Hmm. Or will it not? I don't know. It's probably something that, um, could be confirmed when looking at the baritone source code. Maybe I should do that at some point. But for now, I feel like, uh, what do I want to do? I want to minimize the game. Um, boom. Oh, the the seed thingy my atlas shit um yeah let's see about that one probably not going to open a feature request about a slime map anytime soon Sorry for being minimized. But you know. So, I'm now going to mute myself. Oh, it's almost the end of the episode. So I probably should do that in the next episode. Or I do a cut before 60 minutes. Nah, don't think so. So, that was a productive episode. Oh, it's so nice if you don't have to interact with your game at all and you, are, you don't have to be afraid of walking into lava. Um, I would still sit here, but I will now do um, other things and um, mute myself and see you in the next episode. I'm happy, man. I'm happy. So.
quick recording reset. Probably I should stop walking so don't you that you don't miss something here.